jets and World War II fighters practicing for an air show weren't the only things flying over the water at Kansas City's Caw Point today. Pesky silver carp were also taking to the air. Jason Geckler and Andy Jansen, biologists for Kansas Wildlife and Parks, were surveying the confluence of the Kansas and Missouri rivers for these unwanted Asian fish. Silver carp showed up here in 2004, another invasive species that will compete with native Kansas wildlife. Silver carp, which can reach weights of 80 pounds, are surface filter feeders that eat 40% of their own body weights each day. They're spooky fish and passing boats can provoke wild panic jumping as high as 10 feet out of the water. Silver carp often jump into boats hitting passengers and sometimes causing injuries. Unfortunately, there are no easy controls and silver carp are here to stay. Geckler, the aquatic nuisance species specialist for Kansas Wildlife and Parks, offers this advice when boating in silver carp waters. So if you're out uh, on a boat and out to join the river, you need to be careful if there's silver carp in the area, they'll fly through the air, they can knock you in the head, they can, they can bump you in the, in, the, in the face and really cause some problems that way. So uh, you have to be careful, always wear your life jacket and uh, be on the lookout for flying silver carp. So if a silver carp jumps in the boat, they're pretty good to eat, so you can take them home and eat it. If you don't want to, just go ahead and kill it, because you got to remember, it is illegal to possess live Asian carp. Look out when you're out there, and always clean, drain, and dry your boat and fishing gear when leaving any Kansas water. Help protect our valuable natural resources. I'm Mike Blair for Kansas Wildlife and Parks.